Hello everyone. Welcome back to the ongoing series on world mapping. In our last videos, we have covered the political map of Europe. So today, we will start with the uh, physical map of the Europe. We will study about the important mountain ranges in today's video. So we have also an ongoing course on ethics, integrity and aptitude. There is an also course on the topic of social justice, which is an part of the GS paper 2 of the UPSC APSC mains syllabus okay so we will start with the Ural mountains so you can locate these mountains in the map here now these Ural mountains are the natural boundary between the Europe and Asia okay so this is very important uh, it is a common question in most of the exams as which of the following mountains is the uh, natural boundary between Europe and Asia okay so you can see here it is a natural boundary between Europe and Asia with the highest point is Mount Narodinya which is at 6214 feet okay the next important mountain is Carpathian mountain now these Carpathian mountains are geologically young European mountain chains for forming the eastward continuation of the Alps okay now you can see in this map if we locate the Alps here now this sorry if you see in this map here, this is the Alps and these are the Carpathian Mountains. Okay, and these Carpathian Mountains are the continuation of the Alps. Okay, that is the eastward continuation of the Alps. Right. Next important mountain is the Jolen Mountains. See, such type of mountains are important because uh, such type of mountains either forms the boundary between two countries or multiple countries okay so uh, the probability of questions coming on this type of questions is very much high okay uh, so Jolen mountains forms the border between the eastern Norway and western Sweden okay so if we locate these mountains uh, in this map you will see here is the Jolen mountains okay so this is the border this is the border between the Sweden and the Norway okay so you can locate this in your map right if you locate this in your map and revise this with your map then it will be easy for you to remember right because uh, the pictorial image is always there in the memory right if you go to rot it uh, without seeing the image then it will be difficult to uh, remind okay the next important mountain is the Apennine Range. Okay, also called as also called as the Apennines. Okay, uh, it is a series of mountain ranges bordered by narrow coastlands that form the physical backbone of Peninsular Italy. Okay, now important question that comes based on this is uh, the two active volcanoes located in the Apennine range are the Mount Vesuvius and Mount Etna okay so in either way question may come that uh, in which of the following mountain range the active volcanoes uh, are located okay uh, multiple mountain ranges may come in the question again question may come which of the following are the active volcanoes right so this is important now we will locate this on the map see this is the Apennine range and it is this forms the virtual uh, backbone of Italy right okay mark this in your atlas next the Alps so Alps are a small segment of this continuous mountain chain that stretches from the Atlas mountains of North Africa across southern Europe and Asia to beyond the Himalayas okay so this is such a long range of mountains right and uh, the Mount Blanc is the highest peak of the Alps this is very important okay so you can see the, the Alps in this map here so this portion is the Alps and it stretches till the Himalayas of Asia okay so we have seen in earlier about the Carpathian mountains so this is the eastern arm of the Alps right so these rains stretches to the Asia okay till the Himalayas right next is the next important mountain is the Pyrenees okay so these Pyrenees stretches from the source of the Mediterranean Sea on the east 
to the Bay of Biscay on the Atlantic Ocean on the west. Right? The Pyrenees form a high wall between France and Spain. Again, important. Okay. See, I have said earlier that such type of questions or probability of uh, such type of questions is very high. Right? That which of the following mountains form the natural boundary between these these countries? Right? So this Pyrenees Alps forms the boundary between France and Spain. Okay. So you can see a map here. So this part is the Pyrenees. Okay. This forms boundary between this this Spain and this is France. Right? Okay. So the last important mountain is the Caucasus mountain. You can see this in this map. Okay, so Caucasus mountain is, you can see here, so Mount Elbrus is the greater Caucasus range is the highest peak of this mountain, right? So Mount Elbrus is the highest peak of the Caucasus mountains. Okay, so with this mountain, uh, the video ends with all the important uh, mountain ranges of Europe. Okay, in the next video we will start with the important water bodies of Europe. So thank you for watching.